Hey you guys, it's Amber, and this is going to be a BB Creams review video. I've actually had a lot of requests for this video in particular over the past few months, and a lot of you have asked, what is a BB Cream? BB Creams originated in Korea uh, out of necessity for laser treatment patients. So folks going in for laser cosmetic procedures would actually be given this BB Cream to assist their skin in healing quicker, uh, to also cover obviously the redness and the effects from the laser surgery uh, as well as to just give that sort of flawless finish on their on their face and the beauty industry sort of got a hold of this information and commercialized BB creams and that's where we are today so a BB cream in essence is a glorified tinted moisturizer I say glorified because BB creams actually contain many properties that a tinted moisturizer do not contain uh, that are very, very beneficial for your skin. Not all BB creams are created equal. Many BB creams do different things. Some BB creams actually are for lightening and brightening the skin and other BB creams may be for minimizing fine lines and wrinkles and SPF protection. There are so many different BB cream options. Uh, it's not a one-size-fits-all kind of deal. I started looking into BB creams for several reasons. I have incredibly red, uneven skin. I have a lot of freckling. I don't actually struggle with acne per se, but I do have the occasional breakout. So that was something that also appealed to me that these BB creams would uh, assist in those areas. So the BB creams that I searched for were BB creams that have whitening effects to them or brightening effects, as well as some coverage to conceal and cover those dark spots, those dark freckles, and things of that nature. It's just sort of my story and to give you a little bit of background on what I look for in the BB creams that I use. The first BB cream that I'm going to talk about is by Skin79, and this one's called the Crystal Pearl BB Cream. And it says that it's got diamond infused powder in it, and really what they're saying is, is that this is for folks who are looking for illuminating effects. If you want sort of a highlight glow to your skin, uh, that's what this BB cream is for in particular. Uh, it doesn't have any SPF in this one at all, so there is no sun protection in this BB cream. I would say that this BB cream would be best used for ages 16 to 25. Uh, because it does have a slight bit of shimmer to it, it isn't going to look as natural on those of us that are aging and are starting to get fine lines and wrinkles. This BB cream cream, however, would be a great option for those that want to mix it with their foundation to give their foundation a little boost of radiance. The next BB cream that I'm going to talk about is also by Skin79, and it's called the Super Plus BB Cream. This is what it looks like. This BB cream actually does three things. It's supposed to whiten the skin, minimize wrinkles and fine lines, as well as to create a more elastic, uh, illuminated sort of look on your face. I have to say, this was actually a very good cover coverage level for me. It actually it covered a lot of my freckles. This also offers UVA protection uh, with an SPF 25. Out of my four BB creams though, I would say that this is my third favorite. Um, not because of anything that it's not doing. It's a great cream. It's very affordable. It's simply that the other two creams that I'm about to talk to you about are just exactly what I need. But if you're looking for a great all-encompassing sort of BB cream that's pretty inexpensive, this um, Super Plus is a good is a good BB cream for sure. The next BB cream that I'm going to talk about is one of my favorites. It's by Misha and it's called the Perfect Cover BB Cream. This is what the box looks like. And the great thing about this BB cream in particular is that it comes in two different shades. It's not a one size fits all, which is nice. And um, I'm shade 21 because I am obviously more light to um, fair to light skinned. Those of you that have olive skin or medium to darker skin would wanna check out shade number 23. This BB cream is great for giving that glow about your skin and also concealing those wrinkles and those fine lines, which I'm definitely beginning to notice more and more on my face and the coverage level in this is amazing it covers all of my freckles I'm wearing it today actually this is truly one of the best beauty creams that I've ever tried I will definitely repurchase uh, it's a great cream and it does exactly what I need it to do so it's perfect for me I'm noticing more and more American beauty companies coming out with BB creams of their own as a matter of fact I think Smashbox just released one 
I don't believe it's gotten great reviews um, compared to the uh, BB creams that are coming out of the Asian market. So I was a little leery on trying any of the American BB creams, to be honest with you. That being said, I was in CVS last week and I spotted the new Garnier Miracle Skin Perfector BB cream and I thought, 10 bucks, I should. I'm gonna get it. I had really low expectations for this product, to be honest with you, and it has completely blown me away. This is what the box looks like. And it also says it's for even tone. It says it instantly renews, brightens, evens, and hydrates. And it's for light to medium skin, this one is. It's also got SPF 15 in it, so it does have your SPF protection as well. It's actually got really good coverage. It completely covered my freckles, which I was not expecting. It brightened up those red areas on my face, which I was not expecting. And it really gave me sort of an airbrushed uh, finish on my skin. I was actually shocked that for $10, this competed with my Misha Perfect Cover BB Cream. I am really loving this. Um, I wish it had a higher SPF rating, to be honest with you, but it's a really great product for $10. So if you wanna try a BB cream out that you can get your hands on pretty easily, uh, you may wanna pick up this Garnier Skin Renew BB cream because it's really great. I hope this video was helpful to you guys. I know when I was looking at BB creams, I was completely overwhelmed by all the different options. And if you have any questions about BB creams, feel free to message me or to comment in the down bar and I'll be happy to get back to you on that. I'll also post all of the information about the products I discussed in the down bar for you guys. As always, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. See you later.